Hey guys, it's Crafty Fox, and welcome back to another Minecraft train tutorial video. So today, I'm going to show you how to build this. And it's a V-Line Z-Type coach, and it's specifically the BZN. And I'm not sure what that exactly stands for, but this is uh, one part of the commission that I'm doing for a Mueller 0229. And he also wanted me to build this end class right here, but I'm not finished with it. But the coach was pretty easy to do. So I'm going to make that video right now. So let's get started. So first off, let's take gray wool, make that two blocks above the tracks and three blocks wide and 33 blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, 2, 4, 2, 5, 2, 6, 2, 7, 2, 8, 2, 9, 30, 31, 32, 33. And uh, let's fill the rest in. And this is actually the first time doing the coach before the locomotive. But yeah, if you want to do commissions, I will do the coach and the locomotive that goes along with your train. And uh, they're not really separate. So after we do that, let's take uh, some red wool. Just add that right over here in this corner, kind of diagonal. Let's do that to the back as well. And then let's add, uh, skip a space and add another one. And this time we're going to make it four blocks long. And then do the same thing on this side. And also the front. And I think this is pretty symmetrical, so it's not going to be uh, different on the other side. Actually, there's only one. One piece that's asymmetrical, that's that little thing on the roof. So next let's make the wheels. So we're gonna go down, skip two blocks from the edge and add two hoppers for one wheel. Skip one and add the other two hoppers and let's do this on both sides at the same time. And in the middle, add a stone brick slab. Same thing on this side, so two hoppers, skip a space, two hoppers, stone brick slab in the middle. And uh, once we're done with that, we're going to go over here. Then we're going to take acacia wood slab, just add this under here. And we're going to leave that alone. So it kind of looks like a diagonal of this red-orange color. And do the same thing at the back. And after we're done with that, let's add a door. Iron door in this doorway, like that. And also at the end, like right there. So there's going to be like six doors in total. And then let's add a little doorway around the end door. So we're going to take gray wool, just add that around. Complete border like that. Same thing on the side. And let's make the gangway. So we're going to take cobblestone wall. At three blocks tall right here on each either side of the door and under here let's add stonebrook slab and also one at the top like that and that's how I've been doing all my gangs way gangways right now like so all right so after we're done with that let's take a block of quartz just add that around the doorway like this kind of like a clover shape or maybe is it a clover it's like three leaf clover right and then four leaf is the lucky one so yeah we're just adding it around the door because the door is like that tall and then after that let's take a stone slab and just continue the slab line right in the middle on the sides Same thing on the side. And then on top of it, let's add clay. So where the red wool is, right next to it, we're just going to fill in it with clay. Side two. And then let's add um, pillars. So we're going to make this a one block window 
on the sides and also this side as well and the rest it should be two blocks so just leave a gap of two blocks in the middle like so just continue it and then after that let's take black stained glass and just fill it in although I know in mobile you guys don't have stained glass for some reason which kinda sucks cause then you have to use clear glass which I personally hate I always prefer stained glass so after we do that let's add a uh, sign hardened clay all along the roof I mean not the roof the sides just go all along and we're gonna reach that quartz over there just skip that one go behind it alright so once we're done with that let's go to the bottom and we're gonna have to add this little detail it's not really entirely accurate because I'm not really sure but uh one two uh, we'll just count the windows so we'll just go down the window three so it's like the third window and then a pillar like that so go one two three so the third window after it the pillar we get to start our three block uh, a slap like that and then I think we're gonna skip two I mean three blocks and add two stone slabs like that or just stone brick same thing on this side so like right over here just add three and a little two you know you don't have to do be you don't have to be entirely accurate cuz I'm not accurate myself <laughs> Alright, so after we do that, let's add stone brick on the sides of the roof. So like that, and do the same thing on the side. Alright, so once we're done with that, let's take uh, stone and just add three at the end of this. and. Uh, on one side of the car we're gonna have like this little bump here and I made it a different color so I'm gonna use uh, light wool light gray wool just add a 2 by 3 and then the rest of the roof should be stone and after that uh, we should be done so I'm just gonna fill this in uh, there is no interior of this build unfortunately but that's just to save time or else I'll be spending hundreds of hours and I don't even know if it will be accurate so I'm probably like no it's not accurate the seats are all wrong but then you gotta worry about like the vestibules and stuff so that's pretty much it on how to build the V-Line BZN Z-Type coach I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you again for a Mueller 0229 for commissioning the build, I will have the end class available soon in like a couple days. And anyways guys, if you guys enjoy this video, please hit that like button below. And um, if you haven't already, please subscribe because I will be uploading more videos in the future. And if you want to do a commission, you can just check out my Sellify page. Link in the description. And anyways guys, I'll see you guys later. Bye.